Alright. This is another one I just... Unfortunately, there's a lot you just really can't see. Um, maybe it's the lighting. Okay, you can kind of see it there. There's a, see how one side is clear, and the, the top side is clear, the bottom side is milky. Now, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. See, it, all the facets just look clean on this. Yeah, I don't know how to light this correctly. But, <laughs> it's turning out well. I just did the top, yeah, you can kind of see it there. The top ridge. And one side is a little pitted, and what I was going to try to show is how it was pitted probably because of the way it's milky, whatever those inclusions are in the stone. But when I flip this over, it'll be clearer on the other side. The first thing you need to know is that the only absolute thing is that the meaning and the method are always changing. Once that is accepted, you're on your way to create beautiful essays. Notes on they seem less malleable than others, like math. Alright, I switched to the stuffed turtle wax and my paste on my Corian lap, and yeah, it, it works. <laughs> It's golden, it works a lot better than the WD-40 and definitely works well a lot better than... Uh... But yeah, those are perfect uh, polished facets, all of them. And it, I would say it, it, um, it creates a little resistance and it holds the, it holds the um, diamond grit better and it, it's a little more aggressive in how it cuts because of the tension of the wax. Anyways, yeah, so I'm, I'm quite happy about that. All right, so this one, I have five degree facets, four or five degree facets, and the reason I'm doing that is because the, the, after I've cut this thing down, it's so thin, but I'm, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna facet it anyways. It's a blue topaz. To see the truth. We are always unfolding. Step by step. Step by step. Step by step, step by step, step by step. All right, here's another one. I faceted the top part or the bottom. I don't know. We'll see. It very well may be clear on the bottom side. And this is a. Uh, oxidized it's got some it's a mineralized quartz step by step. Step by step.
step by step. But that only means one needs to just look a little more closely to see the truth. We are always changing. The first thing you need to know is that the only absolute thing is That the meaning and the method are always changing Once that is accepted, you're on your way to create beautiful essays Notes on fixing less valuable than others like man zero or yeah. M zero I'm gonna cut this flat right here all right so this is a piece of quartz and the bottom side is polished this is a piece of It's a garnet. That's a real soft garnet. This is another piece of quartz. Now, the cool thing about this quartz is it has... There's a chance that it could have some gold in it. That's my hope. You see all the rust? It's a piece of mineralized quartz in an area where gold is found. Okay. This is Peridot from Pakistan. Got the bottom faceted. Okay, this. Okay, this is another piece of crystal from the same place, but it's it's clearer and it shouldn't have anything in it. It's just a real small one. Okay, this is the Peridot. This is another piece of I think it's quartz. And then a real nice piece of, of uh, quartz again. Quartz. This piece, this piece, and this piece all came from ground where there's where there's gold. So these are interesting pieces. Alright, this will be the first one I start with.